This is a demonstration of the new builder feature um, in Skydive Designer version 4. Um, it's a huge new feature, I'm very excited that I've finally been able to bring this along. Um, it goes hand in hand with the puzzler feature, which I'll show in a separate video. So straight up here is the builder, it's on the assistance in the design tab, and it lets me build skydives out of various dive pools. So right now I've provided uh, some dive pools which are just you know, some random formations that I've come up with, um, 10, 11, 12s, 9s, um, and also the 8-way and the 4-way uh, dive pool as best I understand them. In future, anybody can build a new dive pool, you can build your own private ones, uh, and I hope that people will build dive pools and share them. Um, please get in touch with me if you'd like to do that. Um, so let's jump right in. I'm going to start with uh, say Rob's 12s here. Um, simply tap on a formation um, and uh, put it into the builder. Um, I can tap anywhere to kind of move the insertion point. So I've got uh, the cats here, I want to put in my facing zipper in the middle there. Um, and there it is. Uh, so we can save that, uh, we can run it, you can see how it flows. Um, I've tried to put people in similar places um, so that the randoms mostly flow together, um, but they don't completely work. And that's where the puzzler uh, will come in. Uh, more on that to come. We can go back to the builder though, and we can look at uh, these points and we can move them around. And you can do this even with a jump that you didn't build uh, out of the builder, just anything you've put in together. You can move points around, uh, you can delete points. Uh, this cat phalanx is one that's causing problems in the flow, so maybe we shift that and put in the compass. Um, and and there we go, so we can kind of get that. That's our jump. Um, so I'm going to delete all these guys. Um, let's go back to the builder. Quickest way to delete your skydive now is to go in and simply delete the points here. And I can pick the eight way dive pool. And I'm going to build a really simple formation. We've got the uh, blocks at the top and the randoms at the bottom. I'm going to start with A. I'm going to pick a switcher. I'm going to pick 11. I've got two variants here 11 left, 11 right. I'm going to pick 11 left. And just to demonstrate that the switching works as you expect, I'm going to go uh, back to the same A. And you see this is exactly the same. You can see in the image. Um, it's exactly the same slot here. So save that. Uh, I'm on my first point and see I've got my dark blue guy on the front of uh, the cat here. So I run this, it goes into uh, the region box uh, and uh, guy's done his switch and coming back to the A he knows he's in memory, he's in his B slot, and he's switched to hold this position. Skydive Designer only shows the first page of the skydive, um, so you can't kind of flip through and keep seeing this in the memory position, um, but we can see they've switched and we can see uh, that that's where he is. So going back to the top of the first page, obviously there's a, there's a big switch here. Um, it's showing that you can build the dive pool with switches in it um, and these will flow through and um, that's uh, yeah that's that's what it does um, I hope that people will add more dive pools um, improve on my dive pools and if you're interested in um, building your own or building and sharing uh, please get in touch and I can explain how to do that thanks for listening